In this video, you'll see how to connect the PayPal payment gateway on your MemberPress site so you can accept PayPal payments. To get started, from your WordPress dashboard, go to MemberPress here on the left sidebar, Settings, then click on the Payments tab. Then click Add Payment Method. Select PayPal here on the dropdown and give it a name, something like PayPal or Pay with PayPal. Then I see two options one to connect live, and another to connect to Sandbox. Since I want to accept real payments on my site, I'm going to choose Connect Live. If you have a PayPal Sandbox account that you're using for testing purposes, you can choose Connect Sandbox here if you want. Just note that Sandbox is for testing only, and if you select it, you won't be able to accept real payments on your site. Okay, so I'll choose Connect Live, and it'll bring up this window. Now, depending on how your PayPal account is set up, you can see this screen here first. In this case, you'll want to select Use Existing Business Account and click Next to continue. Here, enter the email for the PayPal account you want to use. So, I'll enter my email and password. Then, I'll log in. Then, it'll take a moment and prompt you with this. Now, during this process, if you see a screen like this for fraud protection, you're not required to enable anything. You can go into your PayPal settings and enable fraud protection later if you want. You can just click I'll do this later and move on to the process. I'll click Agree and Connect. It'll work to connect, then I'll see this screen. Then I'll click here to close it and it'll take me back to the Payments tab of the Member Press settings. Now I can see here that it's connected. Now, you can choose to connect to Sandbox at any time for testing purposes, but just remember that it will take your site out of live mode and real payments won't work. Then I'll click Update Options to make sure everything's saved. And that's it, PayPal's now connected. Now, I'll show you what this looks like to my users on the front end of my site. You'll notice this checkbox under the PayPal Gateway, Enable Smart Payment Buttons. First, I'll show you what this checkout process looks like with this disabled and then I'll enable it and show you what that looks like too. So I'll open my site in a new incognito window, so I'm not logged in as my site's admin user. Then I'll navigate to one of my membership registration pages. I'll fill out the registration with some fake testing data. Then I'll select PayPal as the payment method. And it shows this button here to sign up. I'll click that, and I can see that it redirects me to this page on the PayPal website. Then I'll log into another PayPal account I have set up for testing reasons, one that's different than the account I used to set up my PayPal gateway as a site admin. If a user is already logged into PayPal in their browser, they won't see this login process. Then you can see here, if I click the price, it gives me some more info about what I'm buying and tells me that it charges monthly since this is a monthly membership. Then I'll select how I want to pay. Then I'll click agree and subscribe. And once that's done processing, it'll redirect me to my MemberPress thank you page as the test user, so I know the registration process worked. And if I go to the MemberPress account page that I have added to my site navigation here as the test user, and go to the Subscriptions tab, I can see the active subscription for the membership. Now, I'll close this incognito window and go back to the Payments tab of the MemberPress settings. Now, I'll come down here to my PayPal gateway, and click to enable smart payment buttons. Then I'll click update options to save this change. Now I'll open my site in a new incognito window again and navigate to one of my registration pages. I'll sign up again with some different fake testing data. And now when I click use PayPal, you can see buttons for the various options this user has to pay. Clicking each one will bring up that same window and the process for each are all similar. Now, I'll go back to the WordPress dashboard to show you one last thing with the PayPal Gateway. Here on the Payments tab of the settings, here on the left of the PayPal Gateway, you see three checkboxes. Enabling and disabling this checkbox will hide or show the name you entered on the registration page. Payment icon will show or hide this PayPal icon here. And description will show or hide the description. And that's it. You've now seen how to set up the PayPal Payment Gateway in MemberPress. See our knowledge base for more information on using PayPal on your MemberPress site. 
If you liked the video, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out our other videos that makes getting MemberPress up and running a breeze.